What's up Knights, Xantos here, and today we're going to be having a bit of a hero spotlight video. Uh, as you know, the Lost Sands event has been ongoing for a while now, and uh, your guild might be curious to try out the expert version of Merit. And uh, this is quite the tanky guild boss. Now, most of us in game have been focusing the Titania Vordry build and uh, trying to build up mage charms and whatnot. And uh, the combo that works best, I find, for Merit is actually Cladis over Vordry. And uh, we're going to be taking a bit of a focus today on why that is. Now, right off the bat, Cladis is an outlaw hero. So you're going to be getting the damage boost because Merit is also an outlaw enemy. But, along with this, when you summon in the expert version of Merit, she spawns in with Protect On, right off the bat. So, she has 25% boosted uh, defenses, right off the bat. So, with Cladis's base power, Dark Bolts, uh, you're going to be able to deal damage to Merit and also dispel all buffs from her, right off the bat. So this is going to be a key part to the strategy. You're going to be removing that protect from her as soon as you go into the next round. Uh, every time you go into a round, you, you just hit that base power, remove the protect from her, and it'll allow, allow you to uh, hit Merit for how she should be hit. And uh, along with this, Swarm of Flies deals a ton of damage with the Mage Charm boost. And uh, it also has the chance to weaken. Uh, the guild boss. Now this guild boss hits really hard once you get up to round 6 and 7, so having that weaken on her is definitely going to help you out. Alright, so taking a quick peek here, you can see that uh, my guild currently has the expert version of Merit up, and uh, we're going to be taking her head on today. Uh, but first, we're going to be taking a quick peek at our uh, build and what we're going to be bringing. As we said earlier, we're going to be bringing Cladis as our offensive hero, as well as Titania for focus and regenerate. Uh, we'll also be bringing my unique outlaw weapon. Uh, my ranged helmet currently has a 55% uh, boost to mage powers. Uh, my arms that I'm bringing as well has a 30% boost to mage powers. And uh, lastly, my chest piece also has 15% boost to mage powers. So overall, we're going to be having a 100% boost in uh, mage powers uh, with all of our collected items. And uh, along with this, we're going to be needing to bring a greater elixir of power so that we can uh, spam Cladis's base power and rage power when we need to. And uh, we should be all set to go here. Now starting things off here, I'm going to punch twice just to build rage as much as I can. I managed to get pretty lucky there too and land uh, two critical hits even without focus. And we're on to round two. Again just punching in bunches, trying to build rage as much as possible. And then two attacks from my axe to take out round two. Now, round three, her health is still not too, too much, so I'm just going to hack away here with my axe. Managed to land all critical hits. Really nice. Definitely helped in my uh, score boost. Now, we're on to round four. Starting things off, we're going to use Cladis' base power to remove... Uh, the Protect from Merit. Then along with this, we're going to be using Cladis's Swarm of Flies. And as you can see, it's doing a huge amount of damage. And uh, again, we quickly clear round four and make it to round five in only one turn. Using our first Elixir of Power so that we can again use the same method that we used for the last round. Use Cladis's base power to remove the protect, and then Cladis's rage power to do a huge chunk of damage and try and weaken. 
Didn't get the weak in there, but it's all right. We killed her. <laughs> On to round six. Same method, using the elixir of power so that we can, again, remove the protect. And then hit for a huge chunk of damage. Even with the uh, unique weaken charm against her, we're still uh, still not getting the weaken. Now that we have focus, we're gonna punch and attempt to build rage. And as well, we're going to throw on our first uh, potion of protection so that we take no damage to merit. Punching here, building rage, launching Cladis' swarm of flies. Nice big chunk of damage. And as well, throwing on that protect potion so that we take no damage from her big attack. Cladis' base power again, doing huge chunks of damage. Unfortunately, didn't take her out there. But this allows us to use a bit of regenerate, gain focus, and punch to build rage. And as well now, we're going into round 7 with Cladis' base power yet again, so that we can again take off that protect right off the bat. Like I said, Cladis' Dark Bolts, removing Protect. Two slices from the Unique Axe. And Cladis' Swarm of Flies. 54,000 damage. Nice, big, huge chunks. Unfortunately here, Merit takes me out. But uh, I managed to score almost 400,000 against her. And uh, I was pretty proud against, uh, proud of that. So I wanted to uh, share, share my strategies and combos. Uh, big shout out to uh, Vex who uh, initially taught me this combo. I just wanted to uh, do another video to help explain it a little bit more. So uh, thank you everyone for tuning in today. As always, uh, I like bringing you uh, those strategies and combos and uh, hope that I can help out different nights in game. Uh, currently, 85% of my audience, though, of people that are viewing my videos are unsubscribed. So if you are checking out my Knighthood content and would like to support me, I would really appreciate it if you smashed on that subscribe button. And uh, I'm going to keep trying to come out with more content weekly. Uh, always doing my best to uh, work for the community and uh, try my hardest. So thank you again for tuning in today. Uh, smash that like button if you enjoyed. And uh, as always, Knights, stay grinding.